The member from Trinity Spadina. Thank you, Speaker. And I, I too, uh, join the minister in congratulating Go Transit for receiving this uh, uh, prestigious award. And I, and I want to thank the men and women uh, who work for Go Transit because they are capable of great work and they demonstrate that they do great work. But I, I want to take this opportunity because uh, Go Transit is a division of Metrolinx to outline some of my concerns around Metrolinx because I don't get that many opportunities. And, 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 the, and the problem that we have is that we need to have Metrolinx that is independent, consistent, uh, one that shows leadership and one that is uh, uh, neutral or at least appears to be neutral. And, and, and I worry that they haven't shown that kind of leadership. And I, and I want to talk about uh, how I see that. So Toronto Council uh, a while back says we want LRTs. And Metrolink says, okay. We have a mayor that comes in, a new mayor that comes in and says, uh, I don't like uh, LRTs, I, I like uh, subways. Uh, and Metrolink says, okay, we, 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 we don't mind that either. And then you got city t council that tells the, the mayor, we don't like your idea, we, we like LRTs. And Metro and Metrolink says, okay. And then city council changes its mind and says, uh, we, we want a subway, uh, not the LRTs. And, and Metrolink says, uh, okay, that's okay with you. It's okay with me as well. You, you see the problem we got. Now, I understand city council can be, uh, can vacillate back and forth, but we can't have Metrolink vacillating back and forth. We need to have Metrolink that is clear about its role because they're going to have to raise $50 billion in the next 20 years. And we need someone that has a vision and a leadership to say, this is what we need to make it worse, Speaker. The TTC and uh, the City Council say the subway uh, uh, replacing the Scarborough RT should run along McCowan Road to, to Shepherd. And then the minister comes in and says, I, uh, I don't like that plan. I, I, I got a different plan uh, because he wants to embarrass the, the, uh, the council and probably the federal government. And he wants to run it along the RT, Scarborough RT corridor. And, and, and what happens? Metrolink surprisingly says, uh, particularly Rob, Rob Pritchard, declares that Metrolink likes Murray's option based on an early analysis. You understand what I'm getting at? They cannot be so easily politically influenced. We need them to show leadership, consistency and independence. And until they do that, we can't trust their work. Thank you, Speaker.